Effects of Cyberbullying I'm Jeannie Nyholm, the Mental Health Outreach Coordinator for Tri-County GLAD. I am Ricardo Nino. I am your Community Educator. I am Adriana Nino, your American Sign Language ASL Instructor. And I will teach you signs on the effects of cyberbullying. What is cyberbullying? According to the consensus of definitions, cyberbullying is defined as a use of electronic communication to bully a person, typically by sending messages of intimidating or threatening nature. The Kids Health website acknowledges that severe, long-term, or frequent cyberbullying can leave both victims and bullies at greater risk for anxiety, depression, and other stress-related disorders. The Stop Bullying website reveals that the common places where cyberbullying manifests are social media such as Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter. SMS, short message service, also known as text message, sent through devices, instant message, IM, via devices, email provider services, apps, and social media messaging features. According to the consensus of resources on cyberbullying, many kids and teens who are cyberbullied do not want to tell a teacher or a parent, often because they feel ashamed of the social stigma or fear that their technology privileges will be taken away at home. The Kids Health website lists the signs of cyberbullying, including being emotionally upset during or after use of the internet or phone. Withdrawal from family members, friends, and activities. Avoiding school or group gatherings. Slipping grades and acting out in anger at home. Changes in mood, behavior, sleep, or appetite. Wanting to stop using the computer or smartphone. Being nervous or jumpy when getting an instant message or text or email. Avoiding discussions about computer or smartphone activities. How can you as parents help in reducing the cyberbullying? The strategies from Kids Health website may vary from child to child. The list may include If you discover that your child is being cyberbullied, offer comfort and support. Let your child know that it's not his or her fault. Praise your child for doing the right thing by talking to you about it. Reassure your child that you will figure out what to do about it together. Let someone at school, the principal, school nurse, or counselor or teacher know about the situation. Encourage your child not to respond to cyberbullying. Limit access to technology. Know your kid's online world. Learn about ways to keep your kids safe online.
I noticed your mobile phone has been flashing often. What's going on? Oh, some people sent me a text. No big deal. Are you okay? What kind of text messages are these? I'm concerned if your phone will keep flashing. I'm okay. Oh, they're from my school. Don't worry. Just let me know if you need my help. I don't know. Did you let the teacher know about this? No, it's not a big deal. The teacher doesn't need to know. Hi, how are you? Oh, I'm doing great. Can you explain what was going on with the annoying text messages? Yes, the text messages were actually the kids from one of the classes. I was fed up, so I decided to notify a teacher about these messages. He reported them to the school administrative people. Awesome, that is a great strategy for you to follow through. I now feel safe and with the school staff on my side and you, thank you so much. Oh, you're very welcome. The words are associated with the effects of cyberbullying. Let's sign these words together in American Sign Language, ASL. Cyberbullying. Cyberbullying. Ashamed. Ashamed. Anxiety. Anxiety. Depression. Depression. Stigma. Stigma. Technology. Technology. Texting. Texting. Email. Email. Phone. Phone. Computer. Computer. Comfort. Comfort. Support. Support. Safe. Safe. We would like to thank Tri County Glad. Life Signs and Interpreting Referral Service. Nine Home Art Studios for blog editing and captions. And Ventura County Behavioral Health, VCBH, for their ongoing support. Happy spring and see you next time.